hello students in this video you will find preparation of lead chloride in laboratory let us see lead chloride is a compound which does not dissolve in water at room temperature but when water is warm water is hot then lead chloride dissolve in it let us see how it is prepared first preparation preparation of pbcl2 in the laboratory lab method you can say lab method how we are preparing in the lab that i am going to tell you then first point name of the method the method used method of preparation method of preparation is double decomposition double decomposition or double displacement method second point is what are the reactants required reactants required for this is lead nitrate crystals are needed to prepare a co solution and a co solution of sodium chloride or dilute hcl is also used but i am going to tell you about sodium chloride third what is principle of this reaction first point is here double decomposition principle when two compounds react in aqueous solution two compounds in aqueous solution react by exchanging their radicals to form two new compounds as the product and one of the product is insoluble in water means precipitate then the reaction is called double decomposition or double displacement reaction in this method lead nitrate and aqueous solution of sodium chloride lead nitrate solution and aqueous solution of sodium chloride react by exchanging their radicals to form a precipitate of lead chloride which is insoluble at room temperature but soluble in hot water and also there is formation of aqueous solution of sodium nitrate hydrochloric acid can also be used there in place of sodium chloride i am going to tell you now reaction what is the reaction needed what is the reaction taking place reaction taking place that is lead nitrate solution react with sodium chloride solution to form lead chloride and sodium nitrate lead chloride is white precipitate and this is aqueous solution and these reactants are also aqueous solution these are reactants these are also in 
aqueous form. Now, if you are using their uh, dilute hydrochloric acid, then here this is used in aqueous form, this is a dilute form, there is formation of white precipitate of PbCl2 and aqueous solution of nitric acid. Then this is aqueous and this is white precipitate and this is dilute, this is aqueous. Now, this reaction or this reaction, but this is, I am going to discuss about this. Now, fifth point is procedure. Fifth point, procedure. How it is carried out? Now, listen about procedure. In this procedure point, first point is prepare aqueous solution of lead nitrate by dissolving lead nitrate crystals in distilled water in a clean beaker and also prepare aqueous solution of sodium chloride by dissolving sodium chloride crystal in distilled water in another beaker. Second point, first point means you prepare the solution and second point means first point you prepare the solution, second point now add sodium chloride solution to the lead nitrate solution slowly with constant stirring. Third point, now filter the solution of the beaker, precipitate is obtained as residue on the filter paper and the filtrate is sodium nitrate that filtrate is rejected. This residual precipitate obtained on the filter paper, next point is this, wash repeatedly with cold water, repeatedly wash. After washing repeatedly, transfer the precipitate or residue to the evaporation dish or china dish and heat it for some time in water or you can say dissolve the washed precipitate, dissolve it in minimum amount of hot water you can say. Transfer the washed precipitate from filter paper to evaporation, evaporating dish. Now dissolve this precipitate in minimum amount of hot water and warm heat it for some time. Now next point, this hot solution in the evaporating dish allowed to cool slowly. Needle shaped, needle shaped, heavy PBCL2 crystals appear in the evaporating dish. Next last point, filter the content of the evaporating dish to get the PBCL2 crystals. Now dry these crystals and collect. This is the way how you can prepare lead chloride in the laboratory. Now let us see preparation of calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate is a compound which is light having low and less density and is insoluble in water. This is a insoluble solid. Calcium carbonate is insoluble in water, light white amorphous solid and let us see how it is prepared. First point, same way you will write as I have told you, preparation, preparation of calcium carbonate 
in the laboratory you will write lab method lab method then first point method of preparation method of preparation you will write in this double decomposition double decomposition or double displacement method this is also known as double displacement method second point what are the reactants required first reactant is here the reactant required is calcium chloride and sodium carbonate is needed for that now and distilled water distilled water now next point is principle of the reaction principle of the reaction what is this principle of the reaction double decomposition i told you when two compounds react in aqueous solution by exchanging their radical to form two products two new compounds and one of the product is insoluble in water that is obtained as precipitate such reaction is called double decomposition or precipitation reaction or double displacement reaction now here precipitate is formed precipitation reaction or double decomposition reaction now calcium chloride solution when react with sodium carbonate solution then they exchange their radical to form an insoluble compound of calcium carbonate white substance and there is formation of sodium chloride solution in aqueous solution form this is the principle of this reaction now let us see here reaction taking place now reaction reaction is here first calcium chloride react with sodium carbonate solution to form calcium carbonate white precipitate plus sodium chloride in aqueous state now i can show that here this is in aqueous form this is white precipitate white precipitate and this is also a solution aqueous solution this is also aqueous solution now procedure in the procedure procedure first point number 1 take a small amount of calcium chloride salt and dissolve in distilled water in a clean beaker dissolve it in distilled water to prepare water extract of this salt solution in another beaker prepare the aqueous solution of sodium chloride sodium carbonate by dissolving in distilled water sodium carbonate in another beaker and calcium chloride in another beaker now next point number b b point is now add sodium carbonate solution in calcium chloride solution slowly with constant stirring and sodium carbonate solution when you are adding there to this solution formation of precipitate starts but you add sodium carbonate solution excess slight excess excess sodium carbonate solution is added to precipitate out this 
salt in the form of calcium carbonate now third point now filter this precipitate and the precipitate obtained as residue on the filter paper was repeatedly with cold water next point now transfer this repeatedly washed precipitate to a china dish or evaporating dish and you dry it this is filter for separation and dry the precipitate you will get amorphous white powdery mass of calcium carbonate this is the way how calcium carbonate is prepared in the laboratory that's all for today again next class i will tell you, tell you next very important and interesting topic of this chapter thank you